Shucky ducky quack quack. <laughs> the boy back. The boy Georgia John 07 back with another video. How y'all doing, man? Let's let's just let's take let's take in this moment, right? Right now it's April 25th. Oh yeah, we're gonna treat this like a time capsule. It's April 25th and it's hot. It's April 25th. Uh we're in the midst of the epidemic course. We still on like stay at home kinda. Uh Governor Kemp. Just came out of nowhere, just did that bold move and was like, you know what? We're going to open up some small business. There's going to be some limitations, all right? But we're going to open up some small business like barbershops and bowling alleys and nail salons. And I think it was movie theaters. But anyway, that's where we're at right now. You know, this is the daily PPE. Matter of fact, I got the shout out to my Auntie Helen and my mom. They made up a mess. I got the Game of Thrones joints. So yeah, this, is, this is the everyday on deck. Always, oh, oh, that's no one. Huh? We got more right here, so I'm good to go. But yeah, that's what's going on. Governor Kemp came out, said open small business. Mama Keisha pretty much was like, y'all, y'all stay at home, don't, don't do that. And then Trump, well, number 45, came out of nowhere. I bet Kemp was so hurt. Trump came out, was like, nah, we don't know what he talking about. He on his own with that. <laughs> Anyway, that's going on in the midst of all of that. I'm here with a video talking about aftermarket rims and how you can get yours and what mines look like, how they riding and stuff like that. So first we're gonna go to the car wash because my car is dirty and pollen is a B word. That's all I'm gonna say just for now. So let's go. <laughs> All right, so let's get into what this video is all about. So, you know, I hit the car wash up because, of course, I got to wash the car and make it look presentable because that's what this video is about. Not just the car, but also your boy that finally got some rims. I finally got some shoes on the whip. It feels great. I'm glad to have them. And I'm going to tell you more about it. So the rims in which I got, and I got notes because I ain't no professional at this. And plus, I got I to gotta pronunciate. So the rims that I got, they are called Marquee. Marquee? Marquee, Marquee. I'm going with Marquee. Uh, the model is Mike three two five nine. So I got that model of rims, and I got it with the red accent. So it's a red accent, and I got twenty twos. I like twenty twos. I feel like twenties is great. Don't get me wrong. Twenties is good, especially performance wise and stuff like that. My car is not necessarily a performance car, but it is a performance car, if that makes sense. So I got 22s because I like it. You know, I want to fill in that wheel gap. I like the look of it more than anything. I'm going for look than anything else, honestly. So I got 22s like I had on my other charger, and they're staggered. And I mentioned something about staggered and how I had, I had an issue with it earlier. But um, overall, after I went to this place, what I'm going to tell you about where I got my rims from. So, yes, I'm going to let you know where I got my rims from because that's the first thing people want to see. You know, oh, hey, bro, I got these new rims. Oh, that's what's up. Hey, where you get these from? What they running? Word? That's the first thing people want. So I'm here to keep everything real. Once again, I only talk about business in which I have personally experienced or people I trust have personally, personally, personally experienced. I think I'm overthinking it. But, um... So, yeah, I'm going to tell you where I got them and how it worked out. But I love the rims. They fit fine. Thank, thanks. Thanks to the guy that called me after I put the order in. They, and once again, I don't want to ruin anything. But so let's just get to the wheels. How about that? 
Let's just get to the wheels. I'm at a park right now, which I didn't know the parks would be open. I'm social distancing. Ain't nobody around. Look, look at her. Look, they over there. They far away. So we good, right? Ain't nobody park next to me. Social distancing. I'm doing it. I about to And that is what it looks like to fall. <laughs> Shit raw, uncut. I bet. So here we go. Three, two, not yet. So by the way, if you're just not watching this video, go ahead, subscribe to my channel, Georgia Giant 07. Go check out I Am Parked Horribly. Jesus Christ. I'm between the lines, but I am parked horrible. So anyway, if you're just not watching these video or this video right now, go ahead and like it. Subscribe, give a thumbs up, comment down below. Let me know what you think about the wheels and my parking spot because I am nasty right now. It look good, but this is unacceptable. I'm gonna have to fix this. So once again, if you're just not watching, go ahead and check the YouTube Jordan Giant 07. My last video I actually put that up. So now you guys are with me all along. Let's check out the wheels. Yes, sir. Gee Louise. See, I got the red with the little buttons, the 22s. I could have did a little bit more. I just went to a drive through joint, but they knew they good to go. These are the wheels and how they fit on the car. Once again, I like them. I got my first compliment, actually, as far as like face to face. I got my first compliment. Look at this parking spot. I'm gonna have to take some pictures of this, man. Parking is my pet peeve. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> That's how I came through today. That's how it is. I'm between the lines, though. Yes, but these are the wheels. Mike three two five nines, I believe so. Shout out to Just Nasty Vinyl. Go ahead, hit him up on Instagram. Oh, as always, what you know about that? Shout out to the Maniac Riders. I miss y'all, man. I feel like I ain't seen everybody in a minute. We still keep in contact though. But yeah, these are the wheels. And let's see the front. Do, 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 do. Where that? Where that? Where that? The fronts are 265 by 35Z by R22s. So I do some. There's some 265s in the front by nine. It's staggered. So on the back, I got 10.5s, and they are 295s by 30 by 22. I gotta get my brake calipers painted. I told y'all I think I'm going yellow, make it pop a little bit because of the red. I would love to do red, but I think that might be too much. I think that yellow will make it pop out. But yeah, so what y'all think about the rims? Like I said, I love them. I haven't had any issues with them. Oh man, see, this is the problem. Uh, my last car, my last charger I had, I got rims on it. I got it at Discount Autos. I was in Washington, this military time. But um, these I put on myself because I ordered them online. The benefits of ordering them online is that it's a better price. And these rooms in particular were like, I don't wanna lie, but I wanna say probably about 15 to 25% off just because of what's going on maybe. I don't know what it is. And I saw them, I liked them. So I was like, let's take benefits of this. See up there, but do you see this? That's the trouble right there see that boat a lot of people were having issues because they would have to shave down that boat especially if you had 10.5 all the way around now looking at it and what I'm thinking now I think I am gonna add spaces just for comfort even though by theory some people say as long as you put a piece of construction paper between that boat and this wheel you should be good but looking at it now I really do think I need to do spacers just for my comfort, just for potholes, and just where I live. That might be the thing to do, though. But other than that, turning and everything, ride quality, is still good. Oh, that's smart. Oh, not no more. But yeah, I like it. I love it. I'm glad to be back on the rims. I think it brings something to the car. 
The only thing I'm missing now, body-wise, physically, spoiler. I need that spoiler, man. It just changes everything about it. But I definitely need that. But yeah, man. This is the car right now. Once again, y'all been with me on every step from when I got the car, when I got the windows tinted, to I put the decals on, and now got the rims on. And once again, there's more coming. Trust and believe. Corona. <laughs> Quarantine-wise or everything. They having a birthday party out here. It is hot. And I got too much wool on my head because the barbershop is closed and I got a hat on. I'm tired of wearing hats. My birthday is next week. And I don't even think I'm going to the barbershop. That'll be, uh, I'll be 31. I'm going to be 31 next week. So my 31 years, other than being the field and deployments, I think it's my first birthday that I'm going to have. That I cannot see my hairline. That's what it is. Dudes are suffering right now because we can't see our hairline. I ain't seen my hairline in about a month. Females, women, y'all wearing those gloves because your nails ain't done. You think you slick. You think you slick. I know what it is. It's all right. We all struggling. We all struggling out here. But um, so let's get more into the details of where I got my rims and how the process went. And I'll let y'all know if, if you got any questions as far. I'll try to answer them. But this where I got these rims from, the price I got them and how they came in and everything. You can't beat it. I personally think, especially during a time like now when you don't want to pull up to a shop and run numbers and try on, you know, I did all this from my home. Bought, purchased, shipped straight to my door and I put them on myself. And I'm gonna tell you how I'm gonna do so. And I'll tell you how you can do so. In one second, as soon as I turn my AC on. G! All right, so after moving to a, another location, this park is very empty and actually is right up the road for me. So it's perfect and there's nobody here. So yeah, so about where I got my rims from and shout out to Saunders, shout out to Calvin, shout out to 300 once again, so many nicknames. Shout out to Chico, they both told me, yo, go check out AudioCityUSA.com. Y'all saw my eyes. I was looking at the center of my phone and not the camera. But uh, yeah, go check out AudioCityUSA.com. They are an online shopping business that you can order your rims. I think they got other stuff too. But um, you go to the website. And once again, let me put this out there. I'm not being sponsored for this or anything. And I only sit here and tell y'all about business or people that I personally have been with or I work with. I got this product here, right? I'm liking it, I'm feeling it, so I wanna let y'all know. So yeah, you go to audiocityusa.com, put in your make and model of your vehicle, and they'll give you a suggestion page, trying to see what size you want and everything else. And you can place your order there. They're having like a crazy sale. With everything going on is a crazy sale going on. Like I said, my rooms were, I forgot what percentage, but they were on a very high discount. So, you know, great opportunity. So you can go to the website, put in your car, what you want. Put in your car and put in what type of size of wheel you would like at least. And then you can choose the finish, whether you want some bronze, some brush, you want black, you want chrome, you want whatever, whatever. Put it in, your size, your boat pattern, and they'll give you a suggestion of like, yo, these wheels will fit your car, you'll be good to go. Now the beauty of it all is that it's a bundle package. You get your rims, and you go ahead and get your tires. And it gets even better than that. They go ahead and balance the tires for you. Because you're going to get a, call, a phone call after you place your order. You're going to get an email saying you got your confirmation number, of course. And that whether or not they're in stock with the wheel or not. They, they keep you very updated as far as with emails. Even phone calls. If you, got, if you need to call, they will answer. But how it works, you place your order. And then you're going to get a call from an expert that works at an actual facility, which I think is in California, because that's where these rooms came from. You'll get a phone call and it's an expert size person, whatever terminology you can think of to go with that. But it's somebody they know about cars and how your car fit. 
I know the dude that called me and I wish I knew his name. He was like, yo, I had a charger. I had 24s. I had all this. I had this. This is what I had to do. But, you know, after looking at what type of vehicle and model year I have, he suggested that I get the staggered because I was all against it. At first, I was going to do 10.5 all the way around. So that way I could just rotate my tires, like I said in previous videos. But yeah, so he suggested like, yo, bro, I know that bolt is there. Some people shave it down. You don't have to worry about that necessarily. You should be good. Let me know if there's an issue so that way I can tell future customers. That's the that's the deal. That that right there can make a deal right there. This dude genuinely would want it feedback so that way for a future customer, he could sit there and tell them, like, yo, I helped a guy that had a 2019 charger and he had issues. So like just be mindful of this. So that, you know, all of those type of all of that type of energy was a good energy from them. And what it was seven day shipping from California to Atlanta, Georgia. That's that's coast to coast. You can't really beat that as far as rims and tires already balanced in a pallet. It shipped to my driveway. This truck pulled up to my driveway, helped me load it into my garage. And once again, the wheels are already balanced. They balance it. If you get the tire package, they will balance it for you. You already know what the rotation of the wheels are. So, you know, you get you put the right wheel on the right side. You can't go wrong. But um, yeah, I had no issues as far as feedback. I had a tracking number. I saw where my rims were throughout the whole West to East Coast travel. I mean, don't get me wrong, it was a little confusion, but overall seven days shipping from West to East Coast with rims and tires all in a bundle, you can't beat that. I really think so. You pay for the shipping, of course, which is a little bit more. And then I also, you don't have to do it, but I did. I got the sensors. I went ahead and got my sensors mounted in my tires. So like, you know, if you don't do that, then once you get your tires and rims, you might have to go to a Dodge dealership or somewhere or order some type of sensors that are wireless or whatever. I want to know when my tires getting low. That's all I want. That's all I want to say. I want to know when my tires getting low. So I have the sensors. I have no lights on my dash. All of these benefits and things that could happen if you just bought some wheels off of Facebook or offer up or whatever, those type of things can happen in which you might have to actually go to a shop, get it done. It might not cost much, but literally I ordered these rims. I got a phone call asking about my vehicle, the size and what I was looking for. Did I have plans of doing anything on my suspension? Did I have plans on doing anything? And I was like, pretty much no. And he knew exactly like, yo, you're going to be good to go with these wheels. And like I said, now, mind you, now, if in two weeks I do a video saying, yo, my tires busted, my rims bent, like erase everything great I said. <laughs> because, nah, nah, whatever. But right now I have no issues with it. But I'm just saying the customer service is great. The website is good. Um, I think it's the best deal. Like I have, so 22 inch rims. I got my tires that came with it. I had my lug nuts with the key and lock, key and lock lug nuts. And I got my sensors. And let's say, I, I paid 2400 for my rooms. 2400 They came to my doorstep. I legitly just used my little in the trunk jack and everything, one wheel at a time, went through and put my wheels on probably. It couldn't took no more than an hour. And I'm not no, I know about cars, but I ain't no hands-on guy. I've changed spare tires and Humvee tires. There's army days, whatever. But I put my rims on myself and they are riding fine. So... I really think that if you want some wheels and you, before you can comment below and say, oh, okay, there's a car coming by, they're gonna look at me like I'm crazy, whatever is YouTube. But if you're looking for some wheels at a decent price and you're willing to at least put them on yourself, go straight to audiocityusa.com. They'll come balanced, they're gonna come with your sensors already, and they're good prices. Like I said, 2400 for rims, tires, sensors, key lock, boats for like it, you can't i feel like you can't beat it me personally and I, like i said i love the wheels i'm not having any issues but i just wanted to make a video explaining where i got it from how what i think about it and just how i think I, it looks good on the car i'm excited i'm glad i'm able to sit here and make a video for everything i'm doing so you guys are sitting here and seeing this build just like i am because it's still a lot more to go but we have in the time of a quarantine and corona, everything goes. We've done a lot of things. I feel like 
once again, if you're just not looking at this video, go ahead and subscribe to it, man. I really appreciate all my subscribers. I'd rather have 80 some solid subscribers than a million flaky people. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like I actually know all my subscribers, so it makes it more personal. So that's why I'm gonna make these videos. I'm gonna tell you constantly about where did I get this from and who these people are, how they work. I'm gonna let you know. I'm gonna be real with you. This is all raw, uncut. I am sweating right now. It is hot. But I wanted to make this video just it. Look at this, man. Y'all remember that cartoon Recess? With a little kid, a little chubby kid had a red hat and his hair be sticking through. That's how my husband is start doing a little bit. <laughs> but uh, yeah, everything's raw and uncut. I just want to make good content. And uh, I'm just a fan of how all this works. So once again, if you're watching, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for supporting. Go ahead and thumbs up. Comment. I only know what you want to say. Just comment where you at. If you're looking at it, say what's up. I don't know. I just want to get more feedback for what more videos you want to see because still coming up, spoiler, exhaust, rap, break caliber. It's a lot coming up still, and there's going to be a video for each and every one of it. I feel bad for people that are not in my area because I'm giving you local people, but if you're not local, you're not local. You know what I'm saying? Now, other things like just, uh, just nasty vinyl, you can hit them up and stuff like that. He might be able to ship it to you, but... Yeah, that's pretty much for this video, man. These are my rooms. I love them. Audio City, USA. Check them out if you're looking for some rooms. And y'all stay safe out there, man. Like, I'm really practicing social distancing, doing what we can. Like I said, Atlanta or Georgia as a whole kind of opened up, but it ain't open. You get what I'm saying? That makes sense. So once again, appreciate y'all watching, man. It's your boy, Georgia Giant 07. I'm out with another one. Please stay tuned. Y'all be safe. Y'all be blessed. That just spit. This is raw. I'm out. You fell again. I'm out. <laughs>